Currently, if you try and trade with anybody, you'll get a notification saying coin transfer disabled. And well guys, this is because of a new duplication exploit. Anything can be duped, not just gold this time. Today we get into the details. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So currently, if you try and trade with anyone, you'll get a notification saying coin transfer or disabled. And while this is due to Amazon trying to fix and exploit many people it seems have taken advantage of. And that is the duplication exploit. Now as far as I am aware this isn't an exploit due to the server transfer error people were getting. This is actually a new old exploit. I say new old because this exploit from what I have read was reported many many months ago during the beta. An exploit which is caused by lag which is said to have been fixed on the initial release of the game, the official release of the game. But seemingly, after one of the patch you saw I've read, this exploit was reintroduced into the game. Now what patch that was, I don't know, but I'm seeing some people say that this exploit has been in the game for about three weeks, four weeks maybe. So yes, a lag exploit, which is common. Uh, it's a common exploit people do use, not just in MMOs. It's an exploit you can still use in Borderlands to this day as well as many other games. It's an exploit which I think is pretty hard to fix also. And to be honest guys, it's an exploit many people, it's one of the first exploits many people try in these new games. Now we actually isn't just trading that's been disabled, you can't buy, sell from trading posts, you can't deposit or withdraw from treasuries, I mean you can't do much. Now Amazon have put out a statement and they said hi all. We are aware of a possible gold duplication exploit that has been circling and we are temporarily disabling all forms of wealth transfer between players, i.e. sending currency, guild treasury, trading posts, player to player trading. Any player that has engaged in the use of this exploit will be actioned against. Once the gold duplication exploit has been investigated and we are ready to turn on the wealth system again, we will update this post. Thank you for your understanding. So I understand why things have been disabled, I mean it makes sense, but definitely it doesn't make sense to me though is how they think they will track and punish every player that's used this exploit. The problem is, it doesn't just end with people who purposely use this exploit. What about people who brought something from a trading post and didn't know it was a result of an exploit? For instance, an exploiter crafts a thousand void ingots puts them up for sale for 10 gold each. Someone just thinks they are getting a bargain and buys them, uses them and their own materials to craft something great. Are Amazon just going to remove that item with all the things, the other things that players use to craft that item and what punish them? I just can't see it happening. What about people who were genuinely just trading with somebody didn't know that said item was a result of an exploit? Or said gold they've sold something they own for is duplicated gold. I mean it's just impossible in my opinion to find and punish everybody who's come into contact with somebody who's used this exploit or the item which is the result of this exploit. It seems impossible to me and it's an issue I feel won't be fixed anytime soon. And I feel the warning put out by Amazon is just one to scare people into not doing such things because I highly doubt like I said they'll punish every person who came across items that were a result of an exploit. It just wouldn't happen and it would take so much work it's unreal and at the end of the day they would be punishing players who probably didn't even know an exploit was even going on in the game. So now it's over to Amazon and hopefully they can fix it because the trading aspect of this game is a massive massive part. But this definitely isn't good news especially if this is an exploit that's been in the game for weeks, four weeks maybe? That's craziness. A massive part of this game has been exposed, taken advantage of and a ton of players have profited off it. So I guess we'll see the outcome soon guys and hopefully they don't just brush it under the rug which it seems as though they have been doing well since this exploit was found and posted. But I will keep you guys updated right here on my channel whenever new news drops. But on that note the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more new world be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.